Good day everyone, welcome back to my channel and for today's video, I will be showing you how to use the OBS Studio for synchronous and asynchronous mode of learning. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more upcoming videos. Okay, so let's go to the obsproject.com and then you will see that you can download this application for free. Wala kayong babayaran dito. Okay? So yeah, it's available for Windows, Mac, and Linux. And one good thing about this um, OBS Studio is you can do the live streaming. A lot of gamers are using the OBS Studio for Twitch, Facebook, YouTube, and other platforms. Ayan. Okay? Now, let's go to synchronous learning. How are we going to apply this OBS Studio for synchronous learning? Okay, by the way, pag sinabi natin synchronous learning, um, it should be both teachers and students are in the class at the same time. Okay? So, yan. Alright? Okay. For example, I am presenting my uh, slide or image, my lesson. So, nakikita pa rin ako ng students. Yan, visible ang video. And may picture ako dito. Okay? So, that is my intro. Okay, by the way, meron tayong mga scenes and sources dito sa OBS natin. Okay, so I will not be teaching the whole or the entire um, tools here in the OBS studio because the most important tools are the scenes and sources. So, yan. Dito tayo sa scenes. Pwede tayong gumawa ng intro, yan, which is like this, the scene to show your uh, display capture. And I also have the scene too. Yan yung example natin na for example, meron tayong lesson. Ayan. And do this one. And then yan. Okay. To show how I apply the uh, the sources in the uh, scene, uh, in the intro scene. Okay. So ayan. So nakikita nyo dito Ayan, nakikita nyo dito yung OBS ko. And then, this is my uh, intro uh, scene. Ayan. Okay, so I can also add other things like audio input. Of course, this is very important. Baka mamaya hindi kayo naririnig ng studyante nyo. Okay? So, you, you, all, you need to have or you need to include in every scene that you have this audio input capture. Okay, so, yan. Sa mga scene ko, scene 2, meron din siya. Kasi I, I tried to record myself a while ago, and I noticed that my audio is muted. Okay? So, always include the audio input capture. And then, ayan, there are other things that you can um, add. Display, game, image, image slideshow alright so yun nga sinasabi ko sa inyo uh, synchronous learning paano natin i-apply ito for synchronous learning ok so let's try to click on the settings ok sa settings we can see the stream ok so you have a lot of options there like twitch YouTube, saan nyo ba gusto mag live streaming? Okay? So, Facebook, ayan. Diba sa Facebook Live, you can comment down your ideas, your thoughts. Okay? So, ayan. Facebook Live. Alright? The good thing about streaming on Facebook is that not only your students are able to learn from you but also other teachers and parents okay so yan um, click on the get stream key 
and then once you click on that it will uh, lead you to this page okay so yeah so create live stream make sure that you have your page you create your page for example um, teacher teacher one page or teacher one learning page okay so um, you will get the stream key there and then you paste it here and then once you're done you'll be able to do the start streaming okay ayan tapos lalabas na yung mga nilagay mong scenes so that is for synchronous learning di ba um, instead of using platforms like Zoom, uh, Google Meet, Messenger, or um, Call, Facebook uh, Call, you can also do the live streaming. So not only your students uh, can learn from you, but also teachers, your friends, and other people that uh, who are uh, participating in that live session. Okay, now let's go to this one. Okay, let's go to asynchronous type of learning. Pag sinabi natin asynchronous type of learning, hindi available yung student on that particular time na nagtuturo yung teacher. For example, habang nag live stream si teacher, okay, so walang data yung, uh, yung student. So, papanoorin niya lang yung, uh, yung, yung lesson mo when he or she has the availability of the internet source. Okay? Instead of um, click on the live stream, you can also do the uh, uploading of your uh, lessons on Facebook or YouTube channel.